Learning objective three teaches you about one piece of analysis called the free cash flow. Okay. And free cash flow uh, is calculated by taking the net cash provided by the operating activities of the company, subtract out your capital expenditures. Now, capital expenditures are basically money that's spent to buy property, plant, and equipment, okay? Fixed assets only, only. Capital expenditures, we're talking about property, plant, equipment. So we're subtracting that out. We also subtract out cash dividends, okay? And of course, all these pieces of information come right from the cash flow statement. Mm -hmm. All right. So how we look at this is here's a uh, cash flow statement for Microsoft showing the cash provided by operating activities. So that's that's the starting point, cash provided by operating activities. We subtract out the capital expenditures. Now look, there's a lot of investing activities here, but you have to think about a capital expenditure is property, plant, and equipment. So any addition to property, plant, and equipment is a capital expenditure. And that's the only thing we're gonna subtract out from that list. The other thing we will subtract out is dividends. And here we'll, we show that it paid 7,455 in dividends. So the starting point minus, so that's cash flow provided by operating minus capital expenditures minus dividends will give us a free cash flow. Put it all together. And our free cash flow is 10,151. And guess what? That's the show. Yeah. yeah. Pretty cool, huh? Pretty cool. Like I said, 